Hi guys, in this video, I am going to discuss about how to display duplicate records in MySQL database. So, at here, I am using EMP2 or table, and here, this is the duplicate to record inside EMP2 table. So, at here, 5002 ID, at here, twice stamp, 1002 is thrice th stamps, and here, 5001 is one time. So, let's write the query. So, at here, uh, first, to writing select. So I am selecting uh, ID column here auto name here after email. So three column selected and here after let's write count. So count is the aggregator function. So inside the count I am going to pass ID column and here after as and here let's give column alias name total and here after from emp2 and here after let's use group group by cross and here make group id to a group here after let's write having cross so having total greater than one so this is the first query where you can uh, find or duplicate values from the table so if I am going to execute here these three lines so see at here uh, it's all are displaying here duplicate to values and unique values so 5001 is the one times so at here this is displaying total one and here after 5002 uh, ID two times so at here it's the displaying 2002 it's three times so that's the displaying three so right here select id name email it's a selected here after or uh, count id so that count the id so here id so id is 5002 is two times so that displayed to here 5001 one times and here 5002 uh, is the thrice time so if i'm going to execute this query so right here it's all our display now here after you can filter the records so add here win total so total greater than one so greater than one then that display only duplicate values so add here 5001 is a one time so this is the unique value and here it's the 5002 and 5002 is the duplicate value so let's give add here so see add here it's only displaying duplicate values so about the group by and having cross I already discussed in my previous video. So please go through that one. So there I explain in detail way. So and here group by is used to uh, make a group. So group on ID. So and here if you uh, see the records of AMP2. So 5002 in one group, 1002 in one group, 5001 in one group. And here after having clause is used to filter the records so I add here having total one now let's see one more another example so add here select id name email count and here let's give add here in place of total c and t from mp2 and your group by so in uh, this example you can make a group by on id here after name and here after email and here after having so let's give at here you can also use count aggregate function so what about the count aggregate function that greater than one so that display only unique value so let's execute here all this three line first so see at here the same output it's coming but at here the difference is at here i passed to three columns id name and email so id name and email so this three value this three row values that make into one group and here after having clause so if or oh, this count is strong so count cnt value count here so this value is now greater than one so that display only unique sorry duplicate record so i have 5002 and 1002 is the 
duplicate element so it's a displaying duplicate now here after let's see another example so add here select and here selecting as job and here uh, from emp2 and give the uh, table alias name capital A and here after let's use join operator and here join select so that is selecting id next or name here after select id name from emp2 emp2 and let's make that in group so making group or on group so group by on id or you can uh, include add here name also or you, if you want then include add here or uh, name email also or whatever you like so if you uh, give add your id so that will also give you a, a unique oh, sorry duplicate record now id name and here after let's use having clause having and here count a star count a star greater than one and here let's give the table alias name b now here after let's use on clause so about the join i already discussed and here on clause i already discussed in my previous video so at here a dot id equal to b dot id and operator both condition must be true and here after a dot name equal to b dot name so this is the query to display or duplicate record so if you execute at your inner query so this is the inner query part so at here I am getting the error message select id name from emp2 and here group by or group by id so add here group by group by id name and having count star so let's execute one more time so this time no any error so add here it's a displaying 5002 and 1002 so this the duplicate records inside emp2 and here after if you execute this or uh, both query inner and upper so see at here it's a displaying only or uh, duplicate value so select a star from emp2 so emp2 at here so a star means uh, uh, all the columns so at here id name email it's all columns now here after join so I'm doing the join at here select id name so if you want here you can include email also let's include email so at here that will now let's execute that so see at here oh here email it's included now from emp2 so it's a making group by on id and name so at your inner query that making the group by on id and name so let's understand first by inner query so id and name so that make in one group so inside to uh, add here or uh, inside mp2 table so 5002 in one group 5001 in group one, one group 1002 in one group so that making uh, group and here after see this query so this is in one group and here after having count star so when the value of uh, count star is greater than four so this value is now count cnt value is only one and here this value is two and this value is three so that here it's so filtering the records so and here it's so 5002 is so, or uh, two times so that it's a displaying 1002 is the three times so that here it's a display now here after for this all point so this the table alias for mp2 now here after on a dot id so a dot id so id value 5001 5002 if both are equal so 5002 5002 so that chain here after uh, 1002 1002 equal that chain here 5002 5002 all equal then that chain so 
so that here I'm getting the only duplicate records so and here it's so uh, 5000 it's also uh, uh, repeated order so I'm gonna display only 5002 is only one time so for this you have to use distinct distinct keyword now if you execute the query one more time So see at here, 1002 and 5002 at here it's a display. So these two records are duplicate. So this is the way we can uh, display duplicate 